kwa majina naitwa Gladys Dama na sema asante kulingana na mtoto wangu vile amepata zile maxi nimehangaika sana nimehangaika mpaka nikafika mwisho kabisa nikajua sijuwezi kufanya lakini kwa vile juzi nilipigiwa simu hapa nikaitwa nikaambiwa amechukuliwa nimesikia raha sana yani nasikia raha hata huyo Mungu peke yake ndo atalipa mimi siwezi kulipa alipata 372 alikuwa ametoa bahari girls mm. so that is the main purpose today uh, we have this uh, uh, event to let you know that we have a sponsorship scholarship for five uh, for uh, children who are needy who are not going to school we want to support uh, the family members who are here by distributing the checks we also have seen that there is a water short, uh, shortage of water we also want to supply uh, day, morning and evening water supply to our community and we also want to have the feeding program which we have in every industry or the plant wherever we are in in kenya so we want to do the same today as we have uh, our chief the local administration uh, the representatives of uh, mp mp are supposed to be here i think they are on the way so this feeding we will start with 1000 uh, where we have uh, known the need to feed uh, the children where uh, because of the drought again i say this feeding program was initiated by our management particularly my chairman dr narendra raval and we would like to have the same feeding program here in uh, pondora kamberi bay uh, sub county uh, kamberi bay ward sorry so there are two schools which we have already uh, uh, selected one is um, bungoni primary and another one is mairani primary and there are two orphanages for whom we also want to support them and uh, uh, mr derrick karisa the deputy head teacher bungoni primary yeah it's true that we have benefited from the company the there are three classrooms and an office that was were recently renovated so right now they are being used by the gss we have accommodated the junior secondary school there so we say we appreciate what the company has done to us they have now even considered for feeding program of which we appreciate yeah thank you so much yes yeah, so right now people are starving we know of the drought there are people who come on an empty stomach in the morning so i believe when they'll have the feeding program there it will help them because uh, of course in fact attendance will increase uh, so we expect even the enrollment to increase out of that yeah